tonight on Air Arms TV, we take an in-depth look at the new Super Sport and Air Rifle from Air Arms, the S510 Ultimate Sporter. We put the new flagship Air Rifle to the test and see if it really does match up to the hype, all on tonight's Air Arms TV. We all know that Air Arms manufacture and produce guns of extreme accuracy and quality, and they have done for generations. But did you know that every gun they design is rigorously tested by some of the best shots in the world before being given the thumbs up? It's the method of rigorous testing that means each and every air rifle designed by Air Arms meets the standards and requirement of air gun shooters. One air rifle that has grown, developed and matured over the years is the Air Arms S510, but now there's a new model on the block. This is the Air Arms S510 Ultimate Sporter, and what a beauty it is. It comes with this lovely going away laminate stock and is based upon the tried and tested S510 platform. It combines sporting characteristics with match grade accuracy. This model is in 2.2 calibre, and it's equipped with an ambidextrous laminate stock. There's a calibre specific built-in moderator, built-in rear sling mount, a smooth and agile side lever action, a fully adjustable cheek piece and butt pad. It comes with two 10-shot colour-coded magazines, an easy-to-read needleless manometer, and a fully shrouded barrel. Air Arms have taken a lot of time and effort to get the S510 Ultimate Sporter just right. They based it on the S510 platform and shortened the action, added calibre specific silencer and basically given it a few upgrades. The S510 is ergonomically designed so it should suit you whether you're a righty or a lefty. They say, the better the fit between man and rifle, the better the shooting. If you're making up for weight imbalance or the gun doesn't fit you properly, your mind's going to wander and you're not going to concentrate on that shot. Well, that gun shoots sweet. The side lever action is super quick. The gun cocks ever so quickly. You don't have to lift your head up out of the way to, to cock the gun. It's really nice. And I can you see I've, I've shot like a, a one hole group with it. Um, the slight shoot is slightly high and slightly to the right, so I'll adjust it a bit, but no complaints for that. This gun works. A lot of work has gone into this air rifle, and it feels that way. You can tell that this air rifle has been manufactured and built using feedback, testing, and even more feedback. Now, as we said before, the rifle's designed to be ergonomic and fit different people. So to get a second opinion, we've drafted in elite international rugby star, Tom Croft. Tom, great to meet you and thanks yeah, for coming down. No worries, pleasure. And Tom, tell us a bit more about what you shoot and your, your history with shooting. Um, I've probably been shooting for about six years. Um, a very good friend of Ian's uh, own biz, more from Service UK, yep. first got me into it. Got me into uh, deer stalking. Um, obviously, with training, it's obviously hard to get out when you can, but we go out occasionally in the evenings and uh, early mornings to a bit of deer stalking. And obviously, when, uh, when the crop's off the fields, rabbits are abundant yep. there. And then, uh, obviously, pigeons as and when. So yep. it's. Uh, it's all squeezes, so, so you get quite a bit of shooting in as well as the rugby? Uh, when you can and when, yeah, when training yeah. allows it. Yeah. Well, you'll also notice that um, Tom is a different shape to myself. So it's really going to put this gun to the test. And he's a left-hander. You up for it? Let's have a go. No pressure. Okay, firing.
How did that go then, Tom? Very nice. It's, uh, it fits in straight away, like saying, very ergonomic for both left and right handers. Yeah. Um, as soon as you mount it, you're straight in on the scope and uh, yeah, to be able to pick up the sides straight away was uh, superb. A lot, I actually struggled a lot with a lot of guns. Yeah. Being able to get in, shoulder it, and this one just uh, slots straight yeah, in. Yeah, it looked kind of natural when you were shooting there, and I noticed as well with the, with the actual cocking lever being on the right-hand side, it didn't seem to be any hassle. Your head was still down, and you cocking away. It was a, a nice quick action, a nice uh, speed cycle. So, should we go down and see how you've done there? We'll have a look. Or we'll look at your sheet. <laughs> Well then, Tom, there's your two targets there. That's just a ragged one-hole group in there, slightly high. You said you did say it was shooting slightly higher, yeah, didn't you? Yeah, only just yeah, sort yeah. Of quarter inch. But uh, I say every time you put it on, it was same with that. Everything's touching. Everything's touching there. Considering that's the first time you've had a had a plink with that gun, that isn't too bad. That's the group I put in slightly high into the right there. I've pulled. Well, I say pulled them. That's obviously how I'm shooting. So, we'll uh, we'll adjust it slightly. We'll drop it down a bit and put some targets out at further ranges and have a bit more of a play with it. That sounds good, let's go. Cool. Brilliant. Well then, that was the range of targets there, and you've, you've hit every single one. You haven't missed one, Tom. No, yeah, we gave it a slight click before we uh, before we started, but just just the trigger. That's, yeah. what, that's what I'm most impressed with. Obviously, the ease of it of shouldering, but the trigger. It's not you know, not a hair trigger, but it's got enough on it just to yeah, give you that a, bit of pressure, and then snaps and. It's a nice two-stage bite to the trigger, yeah, isn't it? It's absolutely a, super. It's a beautiful bit of kit, and it's a quiet as well, isn't it? I mean, we're quite enclosed here. There's a lot of canopy in the trees and everything. It's such a quiet gun. It's. Um, no, it's a winner. It's a winner in my book. Yeah, I'm very, very impressed. And uh, yeah. But um, very thanks happy. very much for coming down and giving us your uh, opinion no, on the gun, Tom. Thanks for having us. It's good to have a, a left hander and someone of a different shape to just prove what it can do, really. Yeah, give me a shout whenever you need me. <laughs> will do, will do. Thank you very much. Right. Cheers, good. Cheers, Tom. Cheers, right. At the end of the day, the Air Arms S510 Ultimate Sporter has been built by shooters for air gun shooters. It doesn't matter whether you're big, tall, small, left handed or right handed, this gun. It's going to fit you. For more information on the Air Arms S510 Ultimate Sporter, visit the website at airarms.uk. To see more videos on YouTube featuring the fantastic range of air rifles available from Air Arms, click on one of the links now. And to be sure that you stay up to date with all the new videos coming to you from Air Arms TV, make sure you subscribe. You and Air Arms, a winning combination.